again these wicked games we play to win the end is near so i begin today Hi, um, excuse me? Hi, it's, it's me, Katie. We met last week. Anyways, um, I just heard that you were a really good listener, and I just, I wanted to talk to you about, about, I don't really know how to say it. Basically, it's like, there's this guy, and like, I like him, but I just feel like if I were an ocean, he would just want to like tan on the beach and not really swim deep in the waters of my soul. Do you know what I mean? It's like if I were a sandwich, he would pick a different sandwich. You know? And I just feel like. If I was the sky and he's a rocket, he just doesn't want to leave the earth. He doesn't want to leave the earth. Do you know what I mean? Oh my god, he's coming right now. That's him. Hey, uh, Katie. Hey, Nick. Well, who is this? I, I don't think I've ever seen you before. This is my friend, Dolores. Have we met? <laughs> Thanks. No, no, I don't dye my hair. I, do, you, do you dye yours? I... It's just because she's naked and covered in gold. No, you can do that. I could do that. Do you want me to do that? <laughs> I love the gold. Yeah, you're beautiful. You. You want me to kiss you? <laughs> I mean, okay. is a feeling. All right, class, you may now begin your test. What? Uh, 
Five minutes remaining. What? Five more minutes? But we, we just started. Shouldn't take you that long. It is a pregnancy test. Dear God, I'm positive. Dude, I just had the weirdest dream. I just had the weirdest dream. Just, just go back to sleep, man. Just. Yeah, you're right. Okay. I'm gonna be a daddy. <laughs> All right, guys. So that was Elkins Auditorium, and now we're gonna make our way over to Smothers Theater. I just wanna let y'all peasants know. I'm not taking any photographs, and I ain't signing any autographs. Wait, so who are you? Are you kidding me? Why don't you ride your tumbleweed back to Texas? Well, bless your little heart. I'm from Alabama. Damn. Y'all don't know nothing. I'm Kanye West. That's my baby mama, Kim Kardashian. This is actually the newest building on campus and recently won the award for prettiest building in Malibu. Hold up, hold up. I'm really happy for you building. And I'm gonna let you finish, Miss Tour Guide. I let you finish. But that building over there, best building of all time. Oh, come on. That joke is so overdone. I told you. I told you it was overdone. So, where are the on campus frat parties? I'm sorry, Miss Kardashian, but we don't have any Greek housing on campus. Hold up. You're telling me someone has to drive our child to parties? <sighs> all right, so this is the art building. This is where all the performance uh, rooms are. Excuse me? Uh, where can we get a drink around here? I'm sorry, Miss Kardashian, but this is a dry campus. You mean like don't shower? No, it means that we don't allow alcohol to be bought or consumed on campus. And with all due respect, Miss Kardashian, you're pregnant. F***ing right she is. Thank you for coming and touring with us. If you like this college is the right place for you, I highly encourage you to apply. Wait, <laughs> you're telling me this is a college? No wonder all these grown f***ing be walking around. We thought this was a celebrity preschool. Our kid's not going to college, he's already rich. Sometimes, in my dreams, I imagine I have Big Daddy's mayonnaise on my face. Squeeze some out on a sandwich, or eat it with a spoon. Welcome, Brandon Christie. Yes, thank you. So, tell me why you think that you'd make a good Javert, Mr. Christie. Ah, oh, well, I played Javert for the past five years on Broadway, and I also have a degree from the American Conservatory of Music. Great. Play it again, Sam, from the last verse. And so it has been, and so it is written, on the doorway to paradise, that those who falter and those who fall must pay the price. Lord, let me find him, that I may see him.
That's everything we need. Very well done. We're gonna make our final casting decisions tonight, so if you're chosen for the role, we'll be in contact with your agents in the morning. Thank you very much. Thank you. He was really good. Yeah, I know. I know, it's very nice to see me. Russell, hello, I didn't know you were on our list. Or that you were saying. But, it's an honor to have you here, Mr. Crow. We'd be glad to hear uh, you regardless. Oh, I thought so. Oh, I brought you milkshakes. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. <clears throat> Yes. <laughs> and so it has been and so What happened? Oh, it. It's 2 a.m. We're supposed to make a decision by now. Uh, uh, Russell Crowe was good, wasn't he? I mean, yeah. Let's go with that. He's a big name. Yeah. Ooh, is that a milkshake? Well, that tastes different. It seems to be sweet, but salty. Add a climax to every meal with Big Daddy's mayonnaise. Mayonnaise is a feeling. Mayonnaise is a feeling. Mayonnaise is a feeling. The only two black men and Miller have been herded into the same room. So? Look at us. Look at where we are. We're on the bottom floor. In the corner. With the room without a heater. Well, I guess that's true. What's your point? Don't you see? The white man is trying to keep us down. Herded in like, like animals. You know what, Ryan? You're right. So I think I actually thought I wanted to be in this room. So wait, I'm in the suite too. Does that mean the white man's trying to keep me down? Shut, Shut up, up, Matt. Matt. Sorry. <laughs> so anyway, how was your day, Matt? Well, you know, it was uh, pretty good. How about you? It was good. So, how are the ladies? Oh, uh, you know. Forever available. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Don't, don't make me do this. What, you're just gonna leave me hanging, Khalil? Ryan, you know I'm terrible at the handshake. That's what we practice, son! Uh, oh, uh, I mean... Uh, uh. I am... I'm it's, so... It's fine. Hey, guys. Hey, Colby. What's up, girl? Hey, Khalil. Check it out. 
Black on the outside, white on the inside. Did you lay some eggs? <laughs> Wait a minute. The scripted jokes, the well-timed guffaws. Are you guys having that sitcom thing without me again? But you are on the show, you're just not in the title. Well, can we just call it, uh, one and a half black men plus a white guy? Well, that doesn't really roll off the tongue, now does it? Well, it could just as easily be one and a half white men. But that's racist. Oh, what, and one and a half black men isn't? Detail. You know what? I'm moving out and making my own sitcom. It'll be called One White Guy. And it'll be better than all of your plethora of racist jokes, you, you, you poop. Did he just call us poop? I don't know, man. Oh, sweet, double stuffed. <laughs> Cause I've got me, myself, and I, and me And I've got everything I ever wanted And I've got everything I need And I am everything I wanna be Myself and I and me. I never realized until he left how much his side is still a mess. Oh, but the pungent odor. Still reminds me of he, himself, and him, and he. And I've got me, oh, I miss you, but only slightly myself. I miss his snoring in the nightly. Roommates fight and Do you want to be on our sitcom again? Yes! <laughs>